Last year, Pakistan, hit by the worst floods in living history, is struggling. After water swallowed 1.7 million homes, as we sat in our homes watching, watching their infrastructure on crutches, the urgency of this humanitarian tragedy is overwhelming. It's left a pool of forgotten need in its wake. See, there's a, there's a hidden violence in the silence a raindrop makes. See, my friends, this existence will be written in Urdu tales to come. A story of a brave tribe, a collapsed people being unearthed and turned with the soil, regurgitating a story of need and a call for help and support. Now, does any of this make sense to you? Does any of this make sense to you? They, they are beautiful and ignored, and we forget in our safe homes, we forget. In our daily lives, we forget that they barely existed before, before the heavy of water squeezed their lungs tight. But if you listen, if you take time, if you listen closely, if you press your ear to the wind, you will hear them singing. Just listen. I've said it before. Does any of this make sense? Can you tell me how we say we love for others what we want for ourselves. But see, love, love doesn't have borders. And it's easy to carve a smile into the moon when you're not standing on it, when you don't see the flood for the trees, when facing east is the closest version of people outside our postcode that we can even see. Now, how does any of this make sense?